Hello viewers, first up disclaimer, this is not a financial advice and I am not a financial advisor, please use your discretion when making investment decisions. Today we are going to talk about uh, uh, Twitter's earnings beat in quarter 3 um, in 2018. Twitter is up over 15%, it's actually up 16.56% on earnings beat. It has, it's now trading at 32.08 which is between its, um, its 200 day and the 50 day moving average. And let's take a look at, and then for the year, it's up 86%. Let's take a look at the details of its results. Twitter came in ahead uh, of analysts uh, financial estimates in its third quarter, reporting 758 million in revenue, a 29% year over year increase and earnings per share being 21 cents. Analysts had predicted the revenue to be 703, that is a beat of 55 million and earnings per share 14 cents was the estimate but it beats by 7 cents which is 21 cents ad revenue was up 29 percent to 650 million and twitter says total ad engagements increased by 50 percent year over year user growth didn't quite match the expectations which, which is like 326 monthly active users lower uh, 326 million i believe lower than the predictions 330 million is probably a typo they missed a million here and also declined from the same period when Twitter had 335 million MAUs. So here um, they give you the monthly active users data and um, CEO Jack Dorsey similarly suggested that the company has been focusing on the health of the community rather than pursuing growth at all costs. We are achieving meaningful progress in our efforts to make a Twitter a healthier and a valuable uh, everyday service. And this is the general stuff that they tell you, I mean, based on uh, what has happened in the past few months about privacy and so on. Given that, total monthly active users are 326 million, average US MAUs are 67 million, 259 million are the average international MAUs. Given that, the company says the average number of daily active users actively increase, actually increased 9% year over year, and the investor relations account to Twitter DAU growth continues to be best measure of our success in driving the Twitter. So at the Eastern Standard Time, 7.55 am, Twitter shares were up 15% and that's the case even now. It's up 16.4% and it's up 86% for the year. So uh, Twitter shares are up over 15% on earnings speed. Again, um, disclaimer. This is not a financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Please use your discretion when making investment decisions. Thank you.